Hey, what's up, YouTube? Um, okay, so real quick, we're gonna make a video on making a decent metal tone on the Axe FX3. Um, we're gonna make a nice rhythm tone, and we're also gonna make a, a nice lead tone. Um, <clears throat> so we're just gonna do that now. Uh, for this video, I will be using my Les Paul Classic. And let's go ahead and start. Okay, we need to set an input and an output. And then we need to connect them. So this is what the guitar sounds like with nothing. Just guitar direct into the X. Um, all right, let's start by adding an amp. Yeah, that sounds good. All right, metal tone done. What's the lead tone? Just kidding. Um, so let's add a cab, and what's the amp they gave me? The Friedman Brown Eye. That is the amp we're gonna work with. Um, we're definitely gonna use a orange cab because I found that it sounds really good with this Friedman um, if I could just find it okay there we go this one right here the citrus 57a um, that one I found it to be more like clear uh, or I found it to have more clarity than any of the, uh, some of the other citrus amps. So we're just gonna go ahead and pick that and listen to what it sounds like now. Not too bad, we can make it sound better though. Um, so we have the drive a little higher than noon. Same thing with all these controls, the bass, mid, trap, everything's a little bit higher than noon. Um, and my presence is also a little bit higher than noon. These are the settings I usually like to uh, set on my amp. Um, you know, you could change them up to however you want. Um, so, yeah, let's add a drive. Um, so, with the drive, uh, what you want to do is turn this uh, drive knob all the way down. You can leave your uh, tone at noon or however you want and turn the level all the way up. Um, we're just going to go ahead and hear what that sounds like. Alright, not too bad, not too bad. We're going to add, um, also a gate just to get rid of some of the, the noise. save this setting as the freed oh, that's not how you spell it fried rhythm alright so that's saved and we're gonna go to our next scene and we're gonna turn this drive off we're gonna add a reverb um, and we're going to be playing through the, this medium spring. Let's, uh, just see what that sounds like. Alright, okay, okay, okay. Um, and then we're going to add a delay. Here's your lead, lead tone, and we're going to name this one Lead 
main. Oh. <gasps> Excuse me. Alright, lead main. We're going to save that. And then we'll go back to our rhythm. <laughs> There you have it. That's going to be it for this video. It's just a real quick video on getting a decent lead and rhythm sounding tone. Um, yeah, um, I will try to put these uh, presets in the description box for, as like downloadable links. If you want to download them so you can um, tweak them, you know, you can very much do that. Um, if you like this video, you know, give it a like. If you want to subscribe, you know, subscribe. Um, but that's pretty much it for this video. Uh, thank you for watching, and we'll see you next time.